Hey, this is Jason Roselle, and welcome to Get Inspired, the official podcast and YouTube show that will empower your mind, body, business, social media branding, relationships, and anything that's holding you back from becoming the best version of you. Listen, before I became a TV personality, an author, a celebrity trainer, a life and wellness coach, and the founder of Caliente Fitness, I was broke obese for 20 plus years, full of stretch marks, full of excuses, and most importantly, here's the deal. I was unhappy. I was able to change my life completely, and since then, I've helped thousands do the same. This show is gonna bring you awesome guests, tons of helpful programs that'll aid you, but most importantly, your questions and topics that will make this show your show. My question is this, are you ready to get inspired? We'll get ready because the show starts now. Are you an overthinker? Oh my God, you are. Guess what? So am I and millions of people out there are overthinkers. Once we realize that, wait a minute, our brain doesn't control us. Our emotions can't control us. We actually can control this, but it's a lot easier said than done, right? So in today's episode of the podcast and YouTube show, we're going to dive a little deep on this so you can just have a more clear picture and take a stand for not being just held in a little circle, a little bubble and saying, oh my God, that's it. I'm overthinking. The day's over. The week's gone. I messed up and then you go into anxiety, you go into depression, forget the nonsense. So let's get tuned in, dialed in into this episode because it's going to be super caliente. Number one, when things happen, say you broke up with somebody, say you lost your job, say maybe, you know, you gained weight overnight or maybe an accumulation of eight months, needless to say, panic hits, right? Sometimes you get depressed, anxious driven and it ruins your day or maybe You know, like a quote that I always say is, wait, what is the quote? Oh, uh, worrying is like debt that may never come. I actually have it in one of my walls, uh, one of these paintings that I have. And and I tell you what, it, it couldn't be more true because even to this day, once you master, like I've mastered not letting your thoughts take over, life truly changes and you become... Oh, like more at ease, right? And do me a favor, if you're watching this on YouTube or maybe you're listening on Spotify or iTunes, all I ask of you is take a screenshot, tag me, Facebook, Instagram, even Twitter, and let me know if this episode helped you because I'm, it's my mission to make sure, especially if you're not a client of mine. I work with hundreds of people each year, whether it's on the phone, whether it is via Zoom, doing mindset, life, wellness, relationship, coaching, even workouts, right? But if you're somebody that's watching or listening saying, man, well, I don't have the access to you. Maybe I'm in a really crappy situation. Give me all the excuses all you want because believe me, I've had them. My clients have had them. Get out of your head, right? Get out of your head because you have one life one body, you can control what you want. You can control how much money is being dished out each month, whether it's on ice cream, going out for cocktails, or investing in yourself, which is number one. Just like I invest with myself, working out, working and hiring coaches to be a better coach to other people that deserve it, that wanna shine. Now, if you want to truly, and I mean truly get out of your head, you need to start and stick to a routine. How do we start this? Number one, journaling is an amazing thing to do. Taking five minutes to journal in the morning and five minutes in the evening before you retire is a game changer. Expressing how you feel, even if it's bad thoughts or good thoughts or goals that you wanna accomplish, this is truly a game changer and you will feel at ease. When you wake up the next morning, and you wrote down the day before, I wanna feel like this when I wake up. I wanna feel like that when I go to bed. I wanna accomplish X, Y, Z. These things do come to fruition and you will feel better. Number two, meditation, meditation. I was someone prior to doing my own guided meditations, which you can check out on the YouTube channel or on the podcast. These are guided. Meditation wasn't for me, I was giving excuses. Everyone's like, oh, meditation's about quieting your mind. And I was like, quieting your mind? 
I have the meeting of the minds up here in my head. I have so many people talking to me, not like I'm crazy, meaning so many thoughts of things happening and I'm like, I can't do that. But I found guided meditation, which it walks you through a journey because you're listening and actually taking action on what's being told to you. And I eventually created my own. So please, guided meditation, do them. If it's not mine, do anybody else's, but do it in the morning, do it in the evening, quiet the mind, feel better, put yourself in a place where you can elevate yourself, right? Because this will give you power and energy, whether it's in your career, your business, your fitness goals, the list goes on. Thirdly, remind yourself, remind yourself that the brain, the brain is such an amazing thing, isn't it? It's super smart, but it also, it's meant our blueprint to keep us in guard, right? It, it lives in installed in fear, right? It wants to keep you safe, right? But sometimes you're playing it too safe or you're letting the mind control you and saying, okay, the li life's over. This happened or this may happen. Forget all the nonsense. Work on yourself. Do these daily tips and evening tips. And I promise you, you will see changes, but you got to want it. You got to do it. And most importantly, just like working out, right? Or a relationship, you don't just do it for a few days, a few weeks, a few months. It becomes a habit and that habit becomes a lifestyle. So it becomes unconscious, right? Because in the beginning, you're going to have conscious thoughts of saying, okay, I got to meditate. I got to work out. I got to do this and that. Eventually, this becomes a habit and this finally becomes unconscious where you're just like a working machine constantly going and going. Anybody, whether they're a superstar NBA player, whether they're a badass musician, <clears throat> they don't start and think every day, do I have to do this? They know what they need to do, right? I need you to put yourself and elevate yourself in a position as you are a badass. You are the one, the rock star. Who cares if you have to inflate yourself? And I've said it in past episodes, look in front of that mirror every morning and talk nicely to yourself. Tell yourself how awesome you are. Tell yourself what you're gonna accomplish and why you're worth it because you are, damn it. Like I said, please take a screenshot of this if this helped you. Tag me on Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. Let me know if this helped you. Give me a one of these or two of these. Share it with your friends. Let me know if you have any questions. Drop them below. And especially on iTunes, if you're listening, I know you can't necessarily drop questions there or comments. Do it on Instagram, Facebook. This is all a community, right? Because what you're going through, a question you might have, might be helping others. And they may say, oh my God, well, that's awesome. I, I ha actually was thinking of that. You ever saw a, t a TV commercial and you saw an invention that came out or a product? And you're like, damn, I thought about that back in 99. Okay, well, why don't you do something about it? This is where I tell you, stop overthinking. You rock it out knowing you control your emotions. I wish you an amazing day. Keep it caliente, stay inspired, get inspired, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're a new viewer, and don't forget to click on the bell so you can get notifications every time a new show releases. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, and feel free to leave your comments. I'm Jason Roselle, and you're watching Get Inspired with Jason.